Hello there, people of the internet. Apparently, you guys don't like the squeak chair. Um, sorry. So, we are doing the long awaited, much confusion, circling name changer. I thought Jack was gonna do it, he thought I was gonna do it. Um, so yeah. It's taken us a while to get this out, so. <laughs> um, finally. Hope and a big happy. thanks to my brother. He is, um, Blackjack McKenna. We're taking this from his coding. Um, so with his, uh, he gave us <laughs> permission. Yes. You guys are going to call um. me Mr. <laughs> Falling Guitar Guy now. Cause my guitar How do they know it's a guitar? They don't know that. They <laughs> just should assume, I guess. No. Anyway. Sure. Um, um, but yeah. Uh, so yeah. Um, so what you want to make is a string. And a string, in this case, it's um some text. So like, uh, um, but it could be like, say you had two ints, two integers um, put together in a, into a string. Then it would be a string. That sounded so odd. Um. <laughs> so, um, what you want to do is, or what I did, or my brother did is, he just copied the, um, GUI server thing, that add server thing, and then he, um, took away one of the GUI boxes, and then, um, he put in some, then he put in a thing that made it, so what he did it was, so he had that text field, um, so yeah. Uh, so this coding will all be in the description. Mm -hmm. um, okay, so now I'm going to explain it, these are just some imports, you don't need all of them. Uh, but I forget which ones you do need, and I never knew. Me, yeah. Um, but anyways, yeah. I'll think I'll. You I mostly might just need release... the keyboard input. That's yeah. one of the main ones. Um. I think I'm probably gonna put my SRC eventually uh -huh. in a download mm -hmm. link soon. I just released my client, so you guys can use that. But mm -hmm. there's probably errors so, in it, like I said. But yeah, that's not the point. Of all this right. Video. So this is the GUI name changer, and it extends the GUI screen because it is a GUI screen. And then these are just some private ints. We probably don't need that. Um, and then this is a private GUI screen, which is a predefined um, thing by Notch. Um, and then this is uh, a GUI text field, um, and it's uh, the server address. And then there's the server name. I forget which one it uses. You could use either one of them. It doesn't matter because they're both text fields. And then you just want to um, take out the stuff about it connecting the servers and make it be somewhere else. Then here's just the general GUI stuff about it. Like this is like the height, the width, where it is, what it's named. GUI name changer, and then there's the cancel, um, and then just what happens. And then this is if the string is longer than if so. So server name is what we're using for the name. If it's longer than sixteen, um, also this is just setting the max. Um, string length to 16 so you could do if server name greater than 16 then do this but they just had it like this um this is just some keyboard stuff um some other stuff which is like the cancel and stuff um uh so then this is just saying that hacks.s which is the string that we made in hacks i believe is, is it there okay we had yeah so that's so this is um in the hacks folder add, um, uh, no you don't never mind I'll so this is just calling that um which is Saying, okay, go into hacks, then find the variable, the string s, and then I want that to equal this, which is defined up there. So you could change, uh, essentially you could change that server name to like player name or whatever you wanted to, except that, that would get more complicated. So oh no, because you could just do like, well, it would, you'd have you to could change just do like actually yes. call packet handshake one and, um, but no, no I mean, yeah, yeah, I'm just saying, okay. it doesn't need to be server name, it just is. Yeah, um, that's just that's what it just was. That's just what it was originally, so Because that's why. we just needed a predefined text field. Um, and then this is just some other typing stuff. Um, and then this is just to draw above it, so if we were to say, oh no, it works on these servers. Hi, oh. No, I just don't know how it is. <laughs> okay, never mind. Server. Um, so this is just saying, oh no, it works on offline server. So yeah. Oh no, wait. Um, what are we doing? I accidentally put that. Okay. Okay. So um. We got it. No, it's fine. Oh, well, you don't need to. We don't need. You don't need to. Okay, so then this is just the um thing that says enter name and then some colors and stuff, and then um so then we go to the hacks folder um, and then this is if. It's engaged. Oh, and also in here, there's something that engages the hacks, the name changer, I think. Oh, no, 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 never mind. Okay, so this is, um, basically, this is where it says, this is your name, um, not the verification stuff. 
that's at another time. Um, so if so, this is just saying if it equals nothing or null, which it does right now. If you were just to not change your name, then it, it will be. Then yeah. it would equal the string that's defined in here. That's s. That's your username. Um, and then if it is, if it doesn't equal null, if it equals something, then it equals hex that s because. If it equals something, it equals what this equals. Same thing in packet two handshake. Um, this is just some other um, packet stuff. So yeah, um, I hope that you have learned from this. Uh, whoops. Uh, I tried to run the individual class. Um, now, do you want to show them it? Uh, yeah. Cool. <laughs> um, can I do some explaining while you do it? Yep. Excuse me for the noise. Sorry about that. I would rather Mr. not be. Chair. I'd still not <laughs> like, like to not be called Mr. Squeaky Chair. But anyway, so what this says. We're so, gonna call you Mr. Annoying Troll. Um. Okay. So basically, this is. Wait. Can you go back a bit? Yep. Okay. So that's it. Made the GUI, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So this is the it. GUI. But so basically, then, this isn't something where in the game you can do like slash name change whatever you want. This is something you have to do out of the game. But yeah. Yeah. So. Um. And then like there's the stuff that only works on offline servers. That's what it is. Uh, <laughs> wait, comment, subscribe. Uh, so then this is a text field, and that has been very loudly playing TF2. I guess I'll say sub. Okay, because I can't change put the rest name. of it in. Mm -hmm. Okay, so change the name then. So then that just set um the string to be something. So now when you join. The server, and then the, your client looks, and pack one login looks, it says, well, does the variable defined in hacks, does that equal something? And then it sees that it does, and then it says, okay, well, then it equals this. So that's your name now. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Yeah, so. Hope us get an AdSense back. Yeah, our AdSense was disabled, but I don't think you guys can do anything about that. I don't know. But anyway, um. So yeah, thanks for watching. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. This is Zach Perkle and Not Mott. Signing off. Thank you. See you guys. Hi, we're back. Um, and we forgot something. Could you go up to where yes. that thing that we forgot is? So we forgot to tell you guys you need to put this in. Um, what you want it is is it's just adding in the GUI, which I've discussed before. So yeah, you just need to add this part in and then down here you need to add what it does. So yeah, then about, I don't know, a few minutes, and uh, so we've so just... yeah, you just want to have that part and that part, which is just the GUI stuff. So, yeah. Which is like, what happens when you do it? Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. Why is this guy keep throwing, like, grenade things? We're making a video. Um, I don't know, I think he's a devil man. Okay, anyway, that... Yeah, sorry. Um, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. This is us actually signing off. Bye.